Hey, I know that felt much better. To uh, my new spot, man. I know in yesterday's video, I said I was going to get on here and give you all kind of like a house tour. I'll give y'all an office tour. Y'all don't need to be seeing where I lay my head at night, where the magic happens. None of that. You don't need to see none of that because this is our home right here. And we got another home, a special place that I'm about to show y'all. So you'll get two rooms today and you might even get a little living room. How about that? I'll give you a living room. In yesterday's video, you saw a quick glimpse of this space, right? This is the main office. It took me a while to set up. Um, if you all could have seen, actually, I'll show some pictures and some videos while I'm talking. If y'all could have seen what this room looked like when I first got here. I mean, you'll see, you're seeing it right now. You, it, it took so much work and I got to thank some of my closest friends for coming and helping me out throughout this process. I couldn't do none of this without y'all. I guess from where I'm sitting on the camera, you can't really see what's going on in here. So I figured I would show you all myself. Hey guys. So this is the space. Um, yeah, I'm gonna walk y'all through how I got it to how I got it. And uh, yeah, come on in. Okay, so the first thing that I wanna talk about is this showpiece of a desk, right? This is a custom desk. Shout out to Laura Woods. Laura Woods Epoxy, I believe on Instagram. Just Google Laura Woods, you'll see them. They make custom wood pieces where they pour the epoxy into, you know, get a little bit of, of this design over here. Make sure that you get this hashtag. That's y'all right there, bro. Every time I walk in here, I'm seeing y'all. The thing about Laura Woods epoxy is that um, each piece of wood is its own custom design. No other desk on the planet looks like this desk. So yeah, shout out to them. Put their Instagram right there on the bottom. Ding! There you go. I didn't think I was gonna need this much space, but I do, I do. I'm gonna probably use this for, um, I don't know, probably like uh, scribbles, you know, coloring, doing some puzzles over here. Coming over here to think when y'all piss me off, I'll be like, damn, these niggas really tripping on me all the time. Then I come back on the camera like nothing happened, you know, just, that's my uh, that's my thought corner over there. That's my thought corner. Oh, 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 you saw this? Oh, my fault, my fault, I didn't get to show y'all yet. Yes, sir, yes, sir. This is the green screen corner. I gotta come up with better names, green screen corner. The green screen, welcome to the green screen working title. As you can see, it's a little rough. Like we're still like probably like 70% finished with the place. You all know that I love virtual reality. I played a lot of virtuality on the, on the channel. Oculus partner, you know what I mean? I got some, uh, some things that I'm gonna put on the ground too to cover it in green. So like this whole thing is gonna be covered in green. And just real quick, if you are interested in what I'm going to do, just look up mixed reality. Oh yeah, we taking over the VR space. My three monitors here. Uh, I'll put the specs on there. You know, I'm not really a spec guy. If it, if it does what I need it to do, cool. But you see the background though, big boy Mega Man Legends. You know, it, it's, it's one of my favorite games of all time. This is my new PC. You know, I used to do the dual PC setup. I figured why not just do everything out of one PC. And hold up, I know y'all see the 3090 in there. Yeah, Big Boy 3090. Yeah, I'm about to do everything 4K gaming, 8K gaming, 3090, Big Boy 30. Everything else in here, I, I don't have a clue. You know what I mean? It was a custom build. Somebody else helped me make, but the 3090 though, yeah. Okay, so probably one of my favorite parts about this office is the TV, right? Shout out to Run JD Run. JD, I'm not even feeling a lot. You have the cleanest setup of all time, bro. You always have the cleanest setups. I definitely took this from his stream. I don't know how you got the game to play on the TV and on your stream at the same time. I'm still trying to figure that out. You, you crafty. This right here, it sets, it, it sets the mood, bro. When I'm on here working and I can just glance over and see like the homie streaming or like check out some tech, tech news. Like I, I always be watching like VR news, but this, is my close second right here, bro. This is my bonsai tree. It's the homie Squidward, see? Cause he got one eye there, one eye there, and then that be no. While I was editing this, I looked at it and I'm like, hold on, is that that man nose or his? I don't know, man. Man, pause, man. This my nigga Squidward in this bitch. Oh, oh, you saw this too? Don't make a big deal about it, cause I can't announce it. Just sneak peek, just sneak peek. You see it, you do, just sneak peek. We somebody, we must be somebody. So you see I got my Batman, you know I love Batman. He got his fists up, <laughs> BLM Batman. <laughs> we got my plaques right here. We got my record player, and you know I got the Earth, Wind, and Fire deck. Wait, 
Pause. You, you know I got the Earth, Wind, and Fire on deck, as well as my shout out to Jesse Jean for this. I know you see it. That's the guys. Is it Tuesday? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um. Wow. Okay. Fuck the TV. This is my favorite part of the office. Shout out to Maya Harris, aka Mama Gold, on Instagram. I'm gonna put her links or her uh, her social on the bottom right. She painted this for me about three, four years ago. She actually did it for her, um, I think it was for her masters at FITM. I think it was like for her thesis project. I can't remember exactly. I, I don't know. I don't know how, how art school works. You know what I mean? She's, she's, she's obviously a genius though. I mean, look at it. Look at the talent, look at the skill. Every time I look at it, I'm like, wow. I really went to, to school. Like I really went to college. That all feels like a blur. That's why you got to take advantage of each day, bro. Do as much as you can. Cause when you get like past that time, you're gonna be like, that don't even feel like it happened. But it did. This is the best office that I've had yet. I just want to say again, thank you to everybody who helped me make this dream a reality. You know, you know who you are. Appreciate all of y'all, all the help. I really do. I think it's time to take y'all to the special room I talked about earlier. So follow me. Oh, and shout out to YouTube Gaming too. They sent me a, uh, a gift for Black History Month. It says, in recognition of Black History Month 2020, YouTube Gaming partnered with San Francisco-based artist Apexer for a limited edition art piece that celebrates you and many other creators from the Black gaming communities. Thank you for being a part of the YouTuber Gaming family. Susan, I got you on a beer. Or wine. Oh, damn. Yeah, this is my little room. You made it. This is where I'll be watching Big Boy Godzilla versus King Kong. They really got King Kong up out of here. That's crazy. I'll be watching that four hour Snyder's cut, you know, got my Sono speakers. You already know I'll be in here just big chilling, cooling. Like this. Or you know sometimes, you know, when my when my uh, back is hurting or my legs is achy, I hop in here. It's not too small. <laughs> All right, last but not least, I want to show y'all my project room because this is what this is what I call the creative room, but you all are gonna know it as the speakeasy. And if you know what a speakeasy is, back in the day they used to have to hide their alcohol sales, right? Because you know it was illegal; you couldn't just be selling alcohol to nobody, to anybody. So you had to be like in the know to, to get even access to these rooms, right? Now you can find a speakeasy at like a bar or something and you walk up to somebody in the back and you like, Garfield. And then they open up the door and they let you in, right? I got my own, come with me. Ugh. He said we can come. Welcome to the speakeasy. You walk in that slow, he gonna kick you out. Be cooler about it. Be cooler about it. There you go. There you go. This is where we'll be hosting the podcast. I don't have the lights on because it gives more of an, a, a nice feeling here. But as you see, we got a bar, we got beverages, we got a guitar if somebody wanna jam out. I am waiting on more furniture so that I can set this up, right? To be like an actual recording space. Right now, it's just a vibe, you know? I can get in here and I can just chill, cool, you know, live life. But as soon as I get more furniture, as soon as I get the right equipment, the podcast will be back on. I know that was something. Man, I don't, don't want to hang out in there, in there too much, man. It's too cool in there. It's too cool in there. So yeah, the podcast will be returning very soon as soon as I get everything that I need. The podcast, how it is right now, is just three dudes really just chatting. But like, I really want to like broaden it and make it more of like a like a like a like a self help slash mentorship slash dudes just talking, shooting the shit kind of podcast. The speakeasy, like you got all all different walks of people coming in there to just clear their mind, you know what I mean? I feel like that's the idea that I want to get with the podcast. So you're gonna see some solo episodes, you're gonna see some group episodes, etc. The link to the podcast channel will be down in the description below. So yeah, now you all know what's kind of taking me so long to get back to these videos. Um, not to mention we were in the middle of a snowstorm, which was kind of crazy for Texas. So you factor all that in, not to mention I was dealing with some, some issues with my lung. I talked about it a little bit on stream yesterday, but I'm feeling good. Um, I'm in 
the best office I, I've ever been in yet. And I'm just ready to get back to work, get back to this content, get back to making y'all laugh, right? This is our spot, man. Thank you again, everybody, for all your support over the years. I cannot do a, a lick of this without you all. You all have changed my life. I will continue to say it for more than y'all will ever understand. I am a dude that was living in his garage when I started this, bro. And I want y'all to see this, not to flex, but to be inspired because to do what I did, it just took dedication. It just took consistency. I didn't have no magic pill, you know what I'm saying? No limitless pill that made me supernatural. Like, bro, I, I was just a funny dude who just knew what he wanted to do, knew where he wanted to get, and I'm still not there. I feel like this year, honestly, is like the first year where I'm really like hitting my stride, bro. And I've been at this for years. So if anybody out there is watching this, like, yo, keep doing whatever it is that you do, as long as it's positive and beneficial to society in some, in some kind of way, or, you know, your family or you specific. Just think about others. <laughs> Cause somebody, <laughs> just think about others, bro. I love y'all and I will see you in the next video. Videos will be returning. Um, but yeah, as you can see, we been working too. And uh, I love y'all, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.